So we're headed up to Woody Gap. Pretty cool. We're on the side of a hill here. It goes way down. So good walking right here, but boy, it's a climb. It's a climb a minute ago. On the road. So I failed to mention, today is the third day of hiking. I can't remember what day it is, Gina. I'm gonna check the phone real quick here. Tuesday, March 26th. So that's the day, Tuesday, March 26th. Heading to a campground. Well, kind of a campground, just a place you can set up a tent. On the way, tomorrow will be Blood Mountain, which is the highest point in Georgia. And I'm sure it earned its name because of the uh, steepness of it and the height. It's the highest point in Georgia on the trail. Um, I understand scrambling down on the downhill side is the hardest part, and you got to be really careful. So, just climbed a big old hill. Kind of cool to see these clouds rolling off the mountain top. Nice little area here, little overlook. You see quite a quite a distance with that the clouds gone. Beautiful. A little nippy this morning, but I'm hiking, so I just got my got my normal skivvies on, my running shorts and t-shirt. So gotta keep moving. So I just wandered onto this little drip of water here, and I'd be a fool not to fill my bag. So I'm gonna take five minutes and chill, baby, chill. Get the bag filled. So I think I'll put it right under that dripping water and like I say, it'll probably take me five minutes, but that's okay. So we made Woody Gap. Wherever that is. So this is a good place we can use the restroom and they've got trash cans to dump our trash. If I get really brave, I might hit you right into town and grab some treats. We'll see. Not in a huge hurry today. My Left leg's giving me fits, my Achilles tendon. So, might be actually a good idea. And I think I could still make my goal miles wise. So, I'm gonna park it here for a minute. So I'm here with my brother, Mac. He just took care of me on Woody Gap. Gave me a ride into Suches. And I think we spent, what, $42? $42. On Snickers bars. That's sorry, right. <laughs> sorry, sweetie. So, thank you, Mac. Hey, Much no appreciated. Problem. No problem. Right on. We're just on our way up to tonight's campsite, Lance Creek. So hopefully we can find a tent there. Got a few hills to climb before we get there, but not long. We're gonna power through. So I ran into some girls headed down. They told me this is called Preacher Rock. They said I'd know it when I saw it. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure we see it. That's my first unobstructed view of this country. A little breezy, that feels good actually. Sorry about the noise on the camera. I almost wonder if I could see Atlanta over there. I'm not sure what direction it should be, but some places on this trail you can see Atlanta. And that kind of looks suspicious over in that area. Nice little gulch down in there. So we just rolled into camp tonight and I think I got the last seat in the house. I'm gonna put my tent right down in this area here. As long as it doesn't rain too much, that hill won't funnel it to me. But uh, I'm gonna take my chances because I don't think it's supposed to rain too much tonight.
So I'm just chilling here in my tent. Got the sleeping pad down there. Sitting in my chair. Oh, you can't right there. You probably can't see the chair. But uh, it's pouring rain outside. So just kind of chilling. Hopefully it uh, doesn't come down too much tonight or we'll be in for an experience that I don't want. But uh, definitely not Wyoming. This is the, the real deal as far as rain goes. And I'm sure it can get 10 times worse. But uh, I'm just having a blast. My body feels really good. That break I took earlier today was, was so awesome. Just zipped into town, grabbed that piece of pizza, and it was just, just awesome. So, rejuvenated my whole day. I was struggling mentally when I got to Woody Gap. I think it was Woody Gap. I can't remember, but one of those gaps where I jumped down to Suchis, uh, his little town, just at a little gas station, and that changed my whole day. So that was, that was cool. I've learned that uh, it's worth taking a midday break, even if it's just for 10 or 20 minutes. Take your socks and shoes off, completely dry out your feet, air out your shoes and socks, and uh, it's just worth it. It's just worth it. Um, you get a little stiff for sure, but you ease back into it and good to go. So, anyhow, just wanted to report on on this day, about out of juice on my little brick that's charging my phone. So tomorrow we should be at Neil's Gap if uh, if we're blessed enough to be there. Blood Mountain, we'll see if it kills us. There's a reason they named it Blood Mountain, I'm sure. I hear it's straight up, but going down is really tricky. I think I've already said this in a previous video. But uh, it's going to be a mental game tomorrow, I think. But uh, I think tomorrow I might grab a shower and nails and do a little laundry. Maybe buy an extra t-shirt. I've been wearing the same shirt the whole trip. Um, I should have kept the shirt I wore on the plane, but I tossed it at the hotel thinking I'd buy one at the visitor center at this trailhead. And uh, of course the visitor center's closed when I get there. So I didn't have a cigarette lighter, didn't have fuel, and the extra shirt, and I wanted to buy a new hat too as a souvenir, but oh well. No harm, no foul. So we just cooked dinner, pulling cats and dogs out there, so not much to do tonight. We've got my chicken going there, warming up some water for hot chocolate, and uh, wishing I had a book to read. So I'll have to remember that. Battery's running low, so I hate to use the phone. So next time I go to town, I'm gonna grab a few pages out of a book and see what happens there. Pretty crazy. This is the kind of rain I expected on the AT. Kind of, kind of fun. It's kind of an adventure for an old fat guy. Like I always say, as seen on TV, listen to that rain. That's looking outside the side of the tent. Just coming down. Here in a minute, I'll set my chair up and just chill. Remember, never cook inside your tent. You have been warned. <laughs> Got a little cup of noodle action going. Yeah, buddy. Hopefully it won't take long. I'm running out of oxygen. <laughs> <laughs> 